everybody at Legend for Life here, bringing you guys something very special. I showed it off in my, uh, uh, like, I don't know what we were going to call it, but my video showed off what I got off of out of Anime St. Louis, and somebody was selling the original uh, two-player starter deck for Duel Masters, a card game very close to my heart. So I'm going to open this up. It's going to be very cool. I'm going to try not damage the box because I want to keep the box. And heck, I'm sure there's a collector watching this just screaming at the at the freaking screen well, saying... Well, we, we can get another one. And by the way, I'm still here! Hello! Hi. I don't know when this video is being uploaded, but I'm still here, just a little bit off screen. You kind of sound like an announcer. I'm doing it on purpose. It's a kind of annoying. It's my announcing voice for announcing things. Okay, well, let me do the... <laughs> no! <laughs> Anyways, so... Oh, God, wow. This is... Very well packaged. Very poorly designed. Are okay. there packs? There's booster packs! Holy crap, there's booster packs! Booster packs! And there is indeed two decks! Wow. That's the whole deck? Is that the whole thing? What? I'm so confused. The, even the decks in Kaijudo are bigger! What the? I'm... Hold on, let me just... Instructions? Okay. Read the instructions, cause this oh, is... Oh, there's more stuff in here! Oh, wait, what? Yeah, there's a like, lot more stuff. More there's, cards? Or? There's a quick start guide. Oh, cool. Um, two playmats. Piece of cardboard to make you think it's bigger. Uh, two playmats. At least we got uh, A comic book? Oh, cool. Yeah, okay. that's it. Uh, two Masters uh, comic book. Oh, that's right cool. And then the Oh, card. hey! Friggin' Bullshock Dragon. One of my favorites. Okay, oh, so. The two starter decks can be combined into one big deck. The oh. super deck. Oh, okay. So these are designed for like play against each other, and then so it's kind of like the clash packs for. Oh, okay, okay. So let's go ahead and pop these open if I can figure out how. And again, I'm sure there's probably a collector out so there. So weird. Yeah. Like, no, I mean the rules. Oh, don't worry. I, okay, we'll play the more updated Kaijudo because this is. Okay. I don't have enough dual master cards to actually build a deck. Okay, so we got the burning main. I remember that card. Oh god, Trihorn Shepherd. I remember using that card a lot in the game. Uh, Dome Shell. <laughs> that was a oh. really good card. Uh, okay. Horn okay, uh, Forest Hornet. I remember that being a fun card. I Forest get Hornet. It. Uh, Golden Wing Striker. I love the card art on these. Like, it's so cool. Uh, Bronze Arm Tribe. I remember using these things so much. And oh, hey, it's a little bit of light stuff, too. I remember using these so much in the video game on the Game Boy Advance. That was a really good game. Okay, I understand the rules. This is really weird, but uh, I get it. Moonlight Flash. I like how to kind of give you a little bit of light stuff, too. That means that the fire stuff probably has a little bit of dark. God dang it. I love the card art on these. Hey, I have oh. one of these. Can you, can you be quiet, please? Sorry, I'm having epiphanies. <laughs> Uh, what the heck is this thing? Eerie Pfizer bullets. Oh yeah, I forgot most of the light guys are called visors for some reason. Oh hey, these things. This is a really good blocker. Uh, Emerald gla the, grass. The quick start guide, which is full of really good information. Cool. Uh, also, a D Max membership offer. What the heck is D Max? Now and receive you more free stuff. Well, th considering this is probably like 1990 something, I don't think that works anymore. Well, technically uh, speaking, Ba or a Giga Sky Guardian. I remember using that card a lot. Hey, another good blocker. Okay. So, wow. <laughs> yeah, cool. Uh, so that's the one deck. That's the... Let me, let me read, no, that's the... Uh, take this, and I'm gonna read it. That's the green and light deck. Oh, okay. Which means this is probably gonna be fire and dark. Probably, yeah. If I had to take a guess. I guarantee you. Okay. Okay. Alright, yeah. So, drag light. There better be Bullshock Dragon in here. There better be. Okay, and what's well, this what guy? If there's Super explosive with folk hand. I'm gonna be upset because he goes, oh, hey, Fire Earth. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Well, how much you want to bet? Okay. Fear okay. something. Fear Fang. Silver Fang. Bronze Arm Tribe. Imagine Burning Mane. Okay, so. Oh, hey, Tornado Flame. I remember that card. Uh, Meteor Sword. This is bringing back so many memories from the TV show as a kid. In a video game. Well, that's okay. actually a really elegant system. I really like the way this is. Yeah, and yet for some reason it still did not do well over here in uh, America. It's still booming in Japan. It's one of the top three uh, f uh, card games over in Japan, but it's not doing well over here. No. Oh, hey, Immortal Baron Vorg. Cool. The system is like really elegant. Like mm -hmm. it, it, it's it's weird. Yeah, we'll play the more updated version of uh, Kaijudo, which is basically a 2.0 of Duel Masters. And then, of course, we got Robus the Traveler, one of the signature cards of the main character from the TV show. Although his boss monster was Bullshock Dragon. 
Uh, here, go ahead yeah, and take a look I'll, at it. I'll, I'll dig you that. And then let's go ahead and open up the card pack. Wow. I wish Yu-Gi-Oh would do this. Give you a free pack in the... In the I don't uh, the magic judge that whenever you get to those two dope packs. Uh, they come with a couple of Chaotic did it as well, if I remember what you, right. What's, what's the most valuable card you can open up out of that pack, possibly? I have no idea. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, shiny. So, it's probably good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Giga Barrels. I remember using that card a lot in a, in a video game. Uh, poisonous Mushroom. Oh my god, on Slaughter Triceps, that's a fun one to use. <laughs> uh, King Coral, that's basically a big whale. Uh, Bronze Arm Tribe, got plenty of those now. Uh, Aqua Fihuko, I remember using that guy too in the video game. Uh, Black Feather Shadow of Rage, I remember that card from the video game as well. Uh, Artisan Picara, okay, so looks like we got three more cards. I don't know when the hollow is supposed to be, if we get a hollow. And god dang it, no hollow. Oh, sad face. Okay. So, yeah, this is interesting. Now, I'm just curious. I mean, you played this before. I don't know. Uh -huh. What's to stop you from just putting all the best cards in the deck? Is like, can red cards only. There's a max or... of four cards, uh, like four of each card in a deck. Right. Well, I mean, like, the difference between, like, why you know, all the, the the colors, the light oh. and the whatever. There is no limitations, but however, in order to summon a monster or cast a spell, you need at least one mana of that card type. So let's say you oh, have. Oh, okay, I got you. Okay, so okay. if it's red, you have to have at least one red, red. creature and, in your yeah, mana so zone. you can have one red, and then every other card in your mana zone can be blue. Um, and you can cast any red. Okay, cool. Yeah. I got you. Okay. I, that's actually, I, I got it. And then it's... here, take a look at the cards. So guys, that was the structure deck. I, I was actually, I'm actually very happy about that. But the actual size of the deck disappoints me because now we don't have enough cards to really do a full duel of that. But I do have my Kaijudo decks still built. I just well, gotta so find them. So these two are built for play against each other. So yeah. we'll, we'll still play with them against yeah. each other. Um, so kind of like with these dual decks that I brought over yeah. are, you know. So guys, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. I love Duel Masters and Kaijudo. I'm still upset that Wizard of the Coast gives up on these so fast. They gave up on... Well, actually, no. Duel Masters is mm. actually doing terrible. It was losing to Yu-Gi-Oh! so hard. But however, Kaijudo, they gave up on so fast. Kaijudo was the remake of Duel Masters for us. And it, it was doing relatively well, but they gave up on it because they did next to no marketing and they were just hoping the TV show would be all their marketing and nobody watches TV anymore. <laughs> so, that being said though, the TV show was pretty good. Thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day. If it's your birthday, happy birthday. See you guys later. Peace out. Bye. Bye-bye.